Welcome back to another EVE Online video, and this is going to be a Solo Omega episode, episode 24, and we're going to be kind of changing, or I guess pivoting a little bit for the series, haven't done um, a whole lot since uh, episode 23, but um, with the holidays and, you know, everything like that, but just my normal null set kind of like routine, you know, just like anything in EVE, I just get kind of like burnt out after a while, uh, we made, uh, we did pretty good in terms of uh, income across the board as far as uh, exports and bounties and things like that. The um, I think with the final number, it might I'm gonna lowball it, but the final number for December, which really when we started counting the income, it was like the fourth or so of December. I'm pretty sure, and I'm still waiting on one more export to get here to Jita, but we ended up doing roughly 25 billion. Um, once everything gets uh, sold and and everything like that so I'm actually uh, pretty pleased with that number considering we didn't play we didn't have a whole lot of game play as far as like hours per day I want to say we might have averaged maybe four hours a day uh, a lot of it had to do with our luck with cosmic signatures being able to do a lot I think we ended up doing like 15 or 15 or 20 um, 8 of 10s over the course of December but moving forward with this series I'm just going to kind of keep this series going but um, Solo Omega never really it was intended to be strictly null sec so what I'm going to do is we're going to be uh, preparing to kind of branch off um, and maybe maybe even explore some you know high yield or um, high isk per hour methods um, that are sustainable for high sec uh, in January but um, I'm actually in the process right now of uh, getting everything that all my assets and everything out of null sec um, just so we can kind of like you know get everything and that's why you do I usually liquidate everything I run with very minimal ships most of the time and depending on what we're gonna be doing um, on the next leg of this uh, series well you know get uh, secure the assets for that and all of those cool things but um, for the most part 25 billion over the course of uh i guess three or you know almost four weeks with a single account is um i'm pretty impressed by it but really kind of looking at you know what i'll be doing probably in high stake probably be doing a little bit of faction war stuff i really you know haven't had a lot of experience with faction war so obviously if you guys have any suggestions for me as far as like fits um or anything like that let me know um i'm really kind of uh, interested in like kind of going on the grind with that i'll probably end up doing some incursion as well also something i do not have a lot of experience with so if you guys have fits or things that you know you want me to try or whatever you know i'm open to uh, advice when it comes to like the stuff that i do not have experience with for sure and then um might be doing some uh doing some more moon mining most likely uh probably level fours probably gonna grind out level fours uh quite a bit but I'm really just kind of interested in seeing, you know, what I can do in the high sec area or even like, you know, I mean, high sec, low sec, really. I mean, a lot of faction warfare stuff like plexing or, and stuff like that is going to be happening in, you know, low sec most likely. But kind of in that, uh, that little domain. And then um, <clears throat> kind of look for, looking further out, um, kind of long term for the series, I'm probably looking at doing some uh, Poshman, some trig space stuff. I still have some work to do with my standings in order to kind of do kind of what I want with that and then probably either kind of at the same time or maybe like shortly after or something I might get like an alt actually or somebody um, set up uh, in, for wormhole space um, I do want to take the main actually into wormhole space and you know do a little bit more for uh, wormhole ratting and things like that but really just trying to branch off and um a lot of um i really kind of want to get null set kind of out of the way early on just because i had the um i was in a situation where i could utilize the system and do the things that i need to do and make the videos i needed to make and uh kind of uh show you guys kind of what my null routine would look like but i'm actually in the process of actually stepping away from um major alliances and and things like that 
mainly because um, the uh, the alliance or my corporation's uh, association right now has been really limiting me on what I can do across the board in New Eden. Most of it is because of just like really long, um, drawn out wars. I mean, we've been in a war since like I think February, so it's uh i used to do a lot of war stuff at alliance level um i really have kind of lost my taste for it for the most part so the big reason why my corporation does not own structures is because i can uh i can freely like leave an alliance and get out of a, a war deck and that opens me up to doing some of the things that i haven't been able to do um successfully or i've had to rely on like unaffiliated alts to do and one of the big uh, motivations for my main character just kind of like endlessly skilling into being a jack of all trades and being max on a lot of things is I don't necessarily want to like train an alt just to do something that my main could do if it wasn't for like, you know, a war deck, for instance. Um, and also I'm just kind of working on, you know, maxing a lot of stuff, uh, a lot of finishing a lot of stuff off with my main as well. I mean, as it sits right now, um, my main is uh, Max Golem, Max Tingu, um, Max Jump Raider, Max Wark, um, Max Missiles, uh, Max uh, Ishtar, Max Mining. Well, as far as Exumers, and uh, we've been doing a lot. I've been doing a lot of like work with um, industry, just getting like a lot of my reaction skills up, and doing a lot of invention lately as well. Um, this one, kind of one of the last things I was kind of messing around with in Nullsec is I was just kind of like making and producing a bunch of buzzard uh, and tech two uh bpcs because i had all of those um all those materials come out of those data sites that i was just kind of like using to uh look at possible revenue uh, streams on the invention side of things and although i've done like reaction and like a lot of moon goose stuff in the past with industry um i really just i, I used to be like a hardcore miner and I'm not really I'm not really wanting to like fully dedicate back into mining like that and you know at the scale at which you would need to like make um, industry profitable so I think probably overall I'm gonna end up being just kind of like a nomad like a drifter you know do some time in you know posh bin, do some time in wormhole space do incursions do faction warfare um, and if I do go back to Null, I will probably just purpose build a alt to go out there and just do exploration as I see fit. But for the most part, I kind of want to, uh, I kind of want to be, uh, always, I've always been kind of a minimalist when it comes to, you know, Eve. And one of my big, big goals really long term is actually become a trillionaire. And a lot of the uh isk that i make i don't hold like i said in the past i don't hold it in liquid form so you know usually when i hit 10 billion i convert it all to uh plex and once it hits plex i basically hold it for a very very long time and um that's been kind of my game of the game for the most part like i enjoy doing all these small little like you know isk making methods but for the most part my sites are kind of set on my uh my net worth as it were and i'll probably do a series when i really start kind of like leaning into like the net worth kind of thing i'll probably start a series going over that but what i'll be doing for the next week or so is just kind of getting stuff prepared figure out what we're going to do um on this next uh like i guess leg of the uh solo omega i'm also open to uh suggestions as well you know what you guys would like to see um yeah, but right now it's we're kind of leaning towards like faction warfare, incursion kind of uh, stuff. So I'm excited to see what you guys, you know, suggest for me to try. Um, and uh, as far as ships and fits and, and everything like that. So thank you for watching. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.